you doing? <laughs> Chef Sharon's here cooking us up a storm. What are you making tonight? We are going to have a healthy option fish fry tonight. Love, love. Tell us how you're feeling. What are you doing? Everybody wants to know and support you on your journey. So I'm doing well. Um, I So the, here's what's going on. I am exercising five days a week. Yes. And I'm doing strength training. So I'm gaining a lot of muscle. Yep. I see my body changing every single day. My pounds are not going down as quick mm -hmm. because I'm gaining muscle and muscle is heavier than weight. So I am now 47 47 pounds down. I have three pounds to go to my 50 pound okay. weight loss. However, on the 21st, I'm going to uh, Boca Raton to have my fourth DEXA scan done, Ooh. which is going to tell me how much muscle I've gained, what visceral fat is around my stomach, what my bone density okay. is. Awesome. It's going to give me all the information that I need to keep going on this health journey in a good speed. Good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's celebrate yeah. Sharon. Give her some Sorry. love. All right. So tell us what we're doing. This is exciting. I love this kind of stuff. So a friend told me about uh, pork rind uh, breadcrumbs, mm -hmm. and she bought them off of Amazon, and it was like twelve dollars for this little tiny bottle. And I was like, wait, chef. <laughs> no, wait. That that's not happening. And it had a Cajun flavor. Well. I decided I was just going to buy the flavors I liked, it liked in pork rind. Mm -hmm. I'm using my Ninja. We put all the pork rinds on the inside. Mm -hmm. And then we just... So we have jalapeno cheddar pork rinds, sea salt, and then your little chili. Classic. So that's going to give you a nice... Like Cajun-y flavor to everything. Mm -hmm. Smell it. Mm -hmm. And it's so easy. It's so easy. It's all done. What we're going to do is it's we're going to... Yeah. Clankety-clank around mm -hmm. in the oh, kitchen. Wow. So we, you know, it's a fish fry. So we're going to use this pan. Mm -hmm. We're going to pour our pork rinds in to here because this is where we're going to mix from the... After we coat our... Uh, grouper. A shout out to my landlord, Alyssa. Thank you for this grouper. It's so good. So fresh. So fresh. So, um, so this is what they'll look like afterwards. Perfect. Perfect. Mm -hmm. Um, and then the next thing we do is you just take some egg, you get your group. So you're going to get your grouper and cut it into pieces like little nugget pieces. Mm -hmm. Make sure you get all the bones out or, you know, if you're eating it yourself, be careful. Don't swallow a bone. Um, that's not good. No. And then you'll be blaming it on me. Mm -hmm. um, <laughs> so then um, you get your eggs and you open them into the bowl. I use some Louisiana seasoning. Mm -hmm. You make it as flavorful as you want. Choose any of the like seafood seasoning that you want. I'm just using a Louisiana boil seasoning. We're going to put it in the eggs. All right. Now we had some over here that I'm going to add to it because we cooked some so we could show you. Just a bunch of eggs. Exactly. I have our unique. Six. Yeah, I did. I think I did like six or eight because okay. we've got a bunch of groupers. So then okay. you just take your grouper, mm -hmm. put it in the fish bowl with the eggs, get them all nice and marinated. You're gonna get your hands messy. It's the only way for the food to be good. Someone's hands gotta <laughs> touch it. That's right. All right, and then. Once it, they're all nicely covered, you can see they got have a color to them now. Let me yeah. They they're the color of the spice in the egg. Yep. Um, might need to wipe that plate up before we use That's it. That's okay. We'll take care of that. All right. Sous chef. Sous chef. Please. Sous chef. Let me get that. All right. <laughs> and then you're just gonna drop them in your chicharrones. I gotta get your basket. Um, no. we do. I'm just going to take a few and put them out here so we can oh, okay. show it. And then Perfect. we'll take those. And then we'll take you want to take those out and put them on a plate? Yeah, sure. And so what we did too for the dipping sauce is uh, we made, I made a remoulade and then I added a relish to it. So we have a remoulade uh, like tartar sauce to dip in. And we've made some ahead of time so we can show it to you really, really quick. The girl, That's what the girls are doing. My Vannas are doing behind me. We're hard at work over here, people. So, um, I have the Ninja Air Fryer. If you don't have one, oh get one. Gosh, yes. 
It, it, it is fabulous. All right, so you want to give me that basket? Yeah. All right. Let's wash my hands. It wasn't too hot. All right. And then you just put it on the basket. Move. 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 There. She's got gloves on, apparently. I just, you know, <laughs> I care about my friend's hands. I have shit. I have chef hands. Um, so anyway, just to, so we don't keep you too long yeah. today, um, we'll move this stuff over here so we can show them the finished product. Absolutely. And then show it to us, chef. So. Oh my gosh. Those are your group like, of are nuggets. Are you kidding me? Yes. Look, y'all. We did them in the oh. air. So the air fryer, I have the Ninja, which Whoop. is right here. And it, I love this thing. Fabulous, fabulous, Eleven fabulous products. I'll let, yeah, do 11 minutes, air fry, 390, and they come out perfect. Juicy, succulent, yeah, good. Towel or something. Your oh, oh, I forgot good. our side dish. But we oh. forgot our side dish. Ah, oh, bad chef. Tell, um, your tell? Here. Okay. All right, so. So we have a fish fry. We don't. We're not going to have uh, French fries. I made carrot fries, ra organic rainbow carrot fries. Mm -hmm. And all we did was cut them to look like a French fry. Yes, they look amazing. Olive oil, garlic, season salt, pepper. Mm -hmm. Stick them in the oven, 425 for about 30 minutes, and they they look just like a French fry. Yes. And they're so good. So you can do this with chicken too. Mm -hmm. Yeah, any kind of meat. So, so Heidi, married a fisherman, don't like fish. And doesn't like fish. Yeah. <laughs> so if you don't like fish, you could do the same thing with your chicken and any kind of pork rind, just cover it in mm -hmm. an egg. You don't, you don't have to use the flour. The chicharroni sticks right to it with, the, with yeah. the egg and it's so good. And just do it just enough so it's nice and tender. I love it. All right. I'm those. No, I was going to put the whole basket on. Oh, good. We'll, well do that one wait, time. Then. Yeah. All right. So it's amazing. So yeah, that's ready it. To taste it. Yeah, I want to taste one. I love anything fried. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> yep. Oh, my gosh. This is so guiltless. Oh, oh my God. That, though. Oh, my hubby would love those. Mm. Y'all, for real? Oh, my God. Wow. Really good grouper too, though. Oh yeah, white light fish, mm -hmm. amazing, y'all. Get on mm. this chicharrones bus. <laughs> oh my god, that's so good. Mm -hmm. Really good. Thank you. I'm just gonna oh, steal a carrot. Eat a carrot. <laughs> Eat a carrot. <laughs> wow. I mean, mm. yeah. And I'm gonna problem. do this with chicken too for my girls because I still use almond flour. Mm -hmm. I don't feel like it does the same thing. Right. Mm -hmm. No. This is so much better. So get yourself. Some of the pork rinds. Have fun in your kitchen again. Exceptional job, chef. Yes, thank Good you. Thank you for showing us. TGIF, y'all. Cheers. Happy hour. Bye. Enjoy your evening. We'll talk to you guys soon. Bye-bye. Bye. Bye. That is good.